We are counting down our top five favorite things to do in Stewart, Florida. Okay, you guys, bonus thing in this video is that this is one of the most Florida things that you can see, and I didn't even plan this. Hi, and welcome to Aiken Adventures. Today we're taking you to Stewart, Florida. Today, we're counting down our top five favorite places to visit in Stewart, Florida. One of the big attractions in Stewart, Florida is the Marriott Resort. And I think the big draw at the Marriott Resort is the uh, golf courses. golf I wish I did because honestly I really love landscaping and I think that golf resorts and golf courses are some of the most beautiful real estate in all the country maybe all the world and it's located just off the water so it looks like people can park their yachts and their boats at the dock I think we've been really surprised by like driving through this area that the roads through this part of where all the beaches are is a little bit different than the rest of Hutchinson Island. Our number five pick for Stewart is the House of Refuge. The House of Refuge is the oldest standing building in Martin County. This is pretty incredible when you consider that it stands directly beside of the ocean, which means that it has endured many hurricanes over the years. In fact, the day that we were there, Tropical Storm Ada was threatening the coast, and so many large waves were crashing onto the rocks. It's easy to see that these coral rocks have protected this building for many years. are the beaches in Stewart. Our number three pick for Stewart is the Oceanographic Center. At the Oceanographic Center, you can feed and pet stingrays. You can also walk around their giant aquarium and see the sharks and the sea turtle. Directly across the street from the Oceanographic Center is the Elliott Museum. Elliott Museum features vintage automobiles and some sports memorabilia and various other Americana related collections as well. The Riverwalk is our number two pick for Stewart, Florida. In the evening, you can stroll there with your family and catch a beautiful glimpse of the waterfront.
Now our number one pick for Stewart, Florida is the historic downtown area. We'll take you there next. downtown Stewart has been voted one of the most beautiful main streets in America and it's not hard to see why. I'm actually really surprised to see many of these places still open. Usually when I visit historic downtown areas, they get everything boarded up uh, before the evening time when most people would probably go shopping. So that's pretty logical to me as a, if I were a business owner to keep my shop open for people who are casually strolling around, especially since this time of evening is very busy on Friday and the weekend. In historic downtown Stewart, you will find a number of shops and boutiques. Our final stop today is going to be to take Vivian to a playground and there just happens to be a great one right at Riverside Park. Okay, you guys, bonus thing in this video is that this is one of the most Florida things that you can see. And I didn't even plan this. Off in the distance there, what do you think that is? That's right, it's a rocket launch. And what's really awesome about that is that we are actually more than 100 miles away from where that rocket is launched. Uh, the Kennedy Space Center is about 100 miles away. Hi, this is Anthony and Elena. If you've enjoyed this video, then we invite you to like, subscribe, and hit the bell notification icon as you follow us for all of our adventures around Florida.